Okay. So, Joey, we're going to start yes. off with some open strings. All right. All right, let me see your bolt hold real quick. I want to see if it's okay. Yeah, for now on, I'm going to let you keep that thumb under the bow since you're still getting used to playing. Feels better. Yeah. All right. Um, play some open strings. Play a few open A strings. Try to keep the less pressure. It'll help. Now up. Good. Now D string. And G string. Try to get a little bit more in between the bridge and the fingerboard. Try not to be so close to the bridge. Alright, good. I noticed now, um, uh, as compared to when before we started the video, your bow, um, bow strokes are getting a lot straighter now that you changed mm -hmm. the way you were holding the bow. Yeah. Because it was looking very tense before, and I think that was what was screwing you up. Um, all right. So now what we're going to do is we're going to start working on left hand. But before we actually start getting into playing notes on the fingerboard, I want you to hold up your instrument and bring your hand up here on the on like the body of the instrument. So bring your instrument up and hold it up. And what I want you to do, try to hold it out more to the side to get um, that shoulder rest caught on you. Here, like, yeah, there you go. Um, so what I want you to do is I want you to just tap your fingers on the top of the instrument. What I, try to um, bring your hand up more and keep, yeah, there you go. And just tap, 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 tap. And now what we're going to do is work your way back and put your thumb right here on the back behind the fingerboard mm -hmm. and now just on the A string just kind of do the same exact thing just move your fingers a little bit see what you and now slowly start moving them back you can move your thumb along with you it'll help and now finally just get all the way back to the end in first position so first position is what is all the way you know in the back at the back of the fingerboard. Now, what I want you to do, um, we're gonna play on the D string. So play, play a few open Ds. Now, what I want you to do is play a first finger on the D string. So put your first finger down and bow on the D string. So it's gonna sound, you're gonna get an E. A little higher. Oh, up, up here? Higher up here? It's, yeah, it's gonna be, that's the sound you're gonna want look for. So you're about a half step off, so bring it up just a little bit. Up as in closer to... Closer to you. from the bridge because you're getting too close to the bridge and you can use less pressure in your right hand just use bow speed instead of pressure so look all right now give me we're gonna do get a second finger f sharp where? So it's going to be a whole step from where that E is played. Same string. So look, we played a D, then we just played an E, now a whole step, 
to F sharp. Good. Now try half step G with the third finger. You're good. Sort of. So now let's go back. Let's go back to that open D, and we'll play all of that again. So it's gonna go. <laughs> so do it again. Close. Start on start on D. First finger. Second finger. Now go to A, the A string, open A. Nope. A. Now you're gonna do the same pattern to finish the scale. So B, first finger B, second finger C sharp, third finger D. Those third fingers tend to be a little high, so make sure you squeeze them closer to the um, to the raised second. So now we're gonna put it together. So it's gonna be. <laughs> it's, it's getting there. We got something to work with. <laughs> something, yeah. No, it's not too bad. Especially, you know, it's it's hard the to play. First time playing notes. Yeah, it's hard to play a string instrument for the first time. You gotta. It's a lot about pressure and knowing how to use bow speed, and like it's. Let me think. It's kind of like a di distribution of bow speed and pressure and it takes a while to find out what the ideal use between those two are you know mm -hmm. so um i'm trying to think of what we can do next um we can go over bow strokes but i'm not sure how effective that's going to be right now mm -hmm. so we'll go over two simple bow strokes